My name is Ashton Zeller and I'm the Chief Scientist at Algix. Algae, you know, kind of plays a role in the environment as a, a tool for nature to remediate uh, pollution. So in the environment, uh, algae will uh, eat small organic molecule, molecules like uh, fertilizers and um, pesticides and uh, pharmaceuticals. So if uh, you do uh, consume antidepressants, you then pee out those antidepressants, they end up in a water stream. Those antidepressants can cause problems with things like amphibians and prevent them from mating. Algae is the cleanup crew for that. So it goes in and it eats those pharmaceuticals, it eats the pesticides, it eats fertilizers, and it produces um, biomass, it produces more algae. The problem is that our environments have been getting so polluted that there's a lot of algae. And so algae itself, even though uh, it's nature's cleanup crew. Its job is to clean water and make water uh, better and more stable for other organisms. If there's too many pollutants, the algae starts to become a problem itself. At night, when there's no sunlight, algae needs to breathe oxygen out of the water. And it's able to pull oxygen out of the water at such a high rate because there's so much algae that it can make no oxygen available to other organisms. Um, so while naturally in a natural environment, algae provides a very important role of cleaning up all those nutrients and pollutants and making sure that they aren't available to cause problems for other organisms, uh, when there's too many pollutants, the algae ends up becoming a problem itself.